welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog if you don't know me welcome my name is Alyssa Marie and today I kind of wanted to take you guys along with me as I'm doing something that I've been putting off for a very very long time I am gonna go ahead and organize my closet today I figured with fall and winter kind of coming around it's like the perfect time to actually do it so I'm gonna be organizing it not only just for fall and winter but also like organizing it in general y'all are about to see it's a little bit of a mess but don't judge me okay i'm being real and showing y'all the mess and then hopefully the after will just look beautiful and fantastic and you guys will still love me and not judge me before we jump right into this vlog please do make sure that you are subscribed to my channel you know the usual all right so let's go ahead and get into this organization all right so you guys might actually not know this but i am living out of the guest room of the house that i'm currently in right now it is a house that i'm renting but the reason why i'm living out of my guest room is because i wanted to take my time and really make the master bedroom something really really nice like i'm talking master bedroom goals okay so i've really just been taking my time getting perfect like the perfect pieces for the master bedroom so it is coming along slowly but surely and yes i am vlogging that entire like transformation so you guys will get to see a video whenever that's completely finished same thing for my home office i mentioned this in another vlog as well i'm taking my time to me i rather just sit down and do it really really slowly and make sure i get the most perfect perfect pieces anyways so yeah i'm kind of just saying that to say that <laughs> this is the reason why my closet is about to look a little bit like a mess because i was like this is not really going to be my closet anyway and i was kind of hoping to have the master bedroom finished a little bit sooner but it's like i said it's fine like i'm totally fine to wait so that i can get perfect things um but yeah i'm at the point where i'm like you know what i need to get this closet organized because <laughs> It's a mess y'all. It is a mess Again, please don't judge me So there was once upon a time where I had things kind of color coordinated Obviously, that's kind of a little bit of a mess right now. So you can see here There's a whole bunch of stuff kind of thrown up there at the top It's because last year when we went from fall to summer I kind of was just like oh, let me just throw all of my sweatshirts kind of on top again I wasn't really planning on being in this room so long but i'm finally actually gonna do something about this because i'm actually really embarrassed at showing this to you guys i'm only okay with the fact that y'all are gonna see me fix it and hopefully i can encourage some of you guys or give you guys some tips on how you can organize your own closets as well what's gonna happen today is i need to organize this again like reorganize i'm a little bit of i will call myself a little bit like borderline ocd i love things to be like super super organized and if they're not then they're like a huge mess like how it is so there's literally no in between i either have it like perfect to a t or it looks like a junkyard so we are literally transforming this from junkyard to pristine perfect like literally instagram goals that's what we're going for so yeah i will be color coordinating i will also be getting rid of some of my more summery outfits and putting them away that is the biggest mistake that i made last year when the seasons changed i literally still just kept everything up in the closet if y'all don't know if you're newer here then you would know that i'm actually a caribbean girl i come from the cayman islands and i just actually recently moved this january 2020 over here to atlanta so this has been like my first time doing the whole seasonal thing because literally it came out in summer all the time so I'm just figuring this out for myself so yeah I realize that there's literally no purpose for all the sweaters and stuff in summer but anyways so actually what I did buy which is one of the things that I was really excited to share with you guys I bought two things from Amazon that I really feel like is gonna really really help me get a little bit more organized so first we have these smart cubes so these are basically under bed storage Dun, dun, dun. So all of my summer stuff is just literally going to be under the bed and out of the way. It won't be like, you know, taking up a whole bunch of space in my closet when I'm not even wearing it. You know what I mean? So I am really excited. Let me open them up and show you guys exactly how they look. All right, so this is what it looks like. I kind of prefer these over the big old bulky plastic under the bed storage containers just because they take up a little bit less space, especially like if you're not using one of them, it literally can just like fold up like that and then just put away somewhere nice and neatly. Whereas the other ones are just big and bulky and out all the time. So you can see here the edge is pretty decent. We can get a good amount of clothes in here and then just stick them right under there 
under the bed. So this pack that I bought came with a set of three of these and honestly, it was pretty affordable. All right, so I did say I bought two things from Amazon that I said is gonna change my life. This is the second thing. So this is a pants hanger. You see how it has that gap there? So let me show you guys what I got last year, which was also kind of a fail. I thought I was doing well. So I got this hanger, which, all right, let me just take it out. So basically, this is a pants hanger that is supposed to hold multiple pants. So I thought, wow, cool, this will be like a really nice space saver. But your girl has so much pants that it's actually difficult to use this hanger. And then once you have so many pants on the same thing, it's like, it's difficult to hang up the pants. It's just, I don't know, it ended up becoming a bulky nightmare and just like a huge mess. So I am so ready to get rid of those. And instead we have our brand new pants hangers. So yeah, those are the two main things that I bought. I also wanted to show you guys really quickly, I did finally organize my jewelry. This is something that I picked up in, was it Ross or Marshalls? Does anybody else get mixed up between those two? It was one of the two and this is like five bucks, 10 bucks. It was not bad at all. And now all of my little jewelry pieces have a special place to go. I also ordered a really nice and bougie kind of jewelry box for like my fine jewelry pieces. So I'm waiting on that to come in as well. And then once I'm able to move into the master bedroom and use the master closet, we'll definitely have a lot more space to kind of put stuff. All right, so let's stop talking and go ahead and do this. I think, I don't know, I'm looking at this and starting to feel like a teensy overwhelmed, but it's fine. I think the most important thing to start with is actually taking out all of the stuff that I won't be using in fall and winter. So that is gonna be my swimsuits. Oh my gosh, let me show you where my swimsuits, my swimsuits have just been right there, just like there, because I also don't have space in my dresser. It's just a hot mess express. I'm literally even gonna be kinda taking stuff out of my dresser so that I have more space in my dresser so there'll be less stuff up here. Anyways, we're gonna get into all of this right now. So yeah, the swimsuits are going in the smart cubes, shorts, maybe even some t-shirts. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. I'm trying to keep this as neat as possible, so I'm not just gonna shove the swimsuits in there, I'm actually gonna kind of fold them and keep them nice and organized. So swimsuits have now been kind of packed away. I did leave a couple of them to the side because I will be traveling home for a little bit. A little vacation. I don't know, I might actually already be on the island by the time you guys see this, but I don't know. We'll see, you'll see. So yeah, now I am trying to figure out exactly what I'm gonna do at the top here. So you can see all my swimsuits have already kind of cleared all of that out. Hershey, can you get out the closet, please? Out, mama. Good girl. I'm thinking that maybe my jeans can go at the top nice and folded, and then I will just kind of reserve down here for pants that will actually get crushed. I think I'll also leave up here for bags and hats. I don't really wanna see too much like clothes folded up there besides my jeans. So actually, before I can kind of create more space in my closet, I actually need to create more space in my drawers. So I think I'm gonna attack these bad boys next and maybe add some more summer items, tank tops, shorts, and all of that to the Smart Cube. So much better. This entire drawer was overflowing. Let me show you my other ones. This is like an everything drawer. Used to be just socks and then I started running out of space. So then I just added any extra pieces of clothing in here. So this is getting cleaned out as well. I also have a little bit of a throw out pile going on here. These are clothes that are well too worn and well too small for me. These drawers being cleared out are definitely gonna help a lot with my closet situation. I actually had one entire drawer in my dresser dedicated to a bunch of hair stuff, so like hair scarves and that kind of thing, and I just realized, why don't I organize that somewhere in my studio? So I actually emptied out that entire drawer, and now it's gonna be my drawer for like my crop tops 
and it's just cute little tops that don't necessarily get too crushed by being inside the drawer so that definitely alleviates a lot of space then you can see a little up ooh, I'm not that one. and then in here i don't think i'm also like not gonna dedicate an entire drawer to socks anymore i think i'm gonna get a basket and maybe stick my socks at the top of my closet up there and then that way my sweatpants and some of my crew necks can come down nice and neatly in here yes this is coming together and sounding like a really good plan i know right now everything looks like a hot mess but sometimes you gotta get messy to get clean all right All right, so here's a little update. I have all of my jeans now sitting on top. Is it the most beautiful site? No, but is it gonna work for me? Absolutely, I don't mind it at all, especially for a temporary closet solution. The rest of stuff that was up here, like my sweatpants and all of that, have now been divvied up into my dresser. So these are all of my more bulky kind of sweatpants, and then I have a few crop tops that I probably will still wear a little bit in the fall, maybe with some bigger sweaters, and then the rest of my crew necks. We're making progress, and it feels good. Okay, the next thing that needs to happen now is very exciting because we are gonna get rid of these. First, they seem like such a great idea, but honestly, they're the worst. So time to bring in the new bad boys. Ready for this? Boom, how easy is that? And it also has like a rubbery type of material, so my pants are not gonna slide off of this thing. Oh, I'm living. And look at how sleek, thin, wonderful. All right, so that's basically it for my pants. I actually didn't have as much pants as I thought. It was majority jeans. So now I'm gonna go ahead and finish weeding out some summer tops and summer dresses, putting them into the Smart Cube, and then we're almost done, wow. So basically, in terms of tops, I'm thinking about tops that will layer nicely and kind of easily underneath a jacket. So for example, like this crop top, like she's cute and all, but with sleeves like these, you can't really like put like a nice jacket on top of it so this is definitely getting put away for summer the print is very summer print anyways i also want to get out of the habit of doing this see like my closet was so packed i had to share hangers with multiple different things on like one hanger and then you end up like not being able to see any of them so yeah we're getting out of that today bright colored sleeveless dresses i mean normally maybe i would have kept it for like christmas or whatever when there's like events but you see the way the world is set up i don't really think there's gonna be anywhere where i can wear this so this is getting put away too goodbye summer i'm actually really looking forward to the fall Let's do something fun. What is your favorite season? Go ahead, comment below, let me know. I think in terms of fashion, I think fall is my favorite season. It used to be spring, but with spring there's too many bugs. I just can't deal with all the bugs. So I think fall might actually be my new favorite season here in Atlanta. Smart cube number one full of stuff we don't need. Oh, you guys will appreciate this one. This is from my ASOS haul. I can't believe it's already the end of summer. I feel like I literally just bought this and I got to wear it like twice. Look at my dressy self. Back in the day when we used to go to fun and flashy events. Remember those days? Wasn't that fun? To the smart cube it goes. Whew. This is, look at her, she's trying to figure out why all of those smart cubes are underneath her little spot under the bed. Anyways, this is, whew, this is taking time, this is taking a lot of energy, but we are definitely making some progress. Ta-da! Oh my gosh, you guys, this literally feels so good. This needed to have been done from a long, long time ago. Oh, 
So usually for my coats, like my heavier coats for when it's a lot more colder, maybe more towards winter time, I actually keep those downstairs. I have like this little mini closet that is like right before you head out to the garage and the front door. So it's like perfect. I just kind of like throw that on and go. So yeah, I don't actually have to worry about fitting like those big, thick, heavy duty coats in here. So I am really, really happy and so satisfied. Oh my gosh, my OCD is like singing right now. It's like, yes, because this just feels so, so good. And I love the fact that I have space for empty hangers because you know what this means? We gotta go shopping. So the very last thing that I want to actually do is go ahead and get a basket for these socks. I'm already in full on cleaning and organizing mode. So I'm gonna go ahead and head out to Target and show you guys what basket options I see out there. I'll catch y'all in Target. All right, so here is the basket selection at Target. And now I just gotta decide which one I need. So, mom, which one do you think? This could also work for socks. Pretty chill. I like how low it is so I can actually see what's inside. Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm actually just gonna get two these okay hold up wait a minute I found some that are just as cute and so much cheaper two dollars four dollars that is the kind of price that I like to see so I think maybe I'll just get two of these maybe three because they're so much cheaper that like, why not? <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm gonna need to officially go back and get a bigger size, but I'm not mad because they were so cheap. So I'm still pretty happy with this. It's gonna be the perfect final addition to my super clean closet. I am living. So yeah, guys, that is basically it. Thanks for joining along with me as I organized this mess of a closet. Thanks so much for watching guys. I will catch you in the next one. Bye.